Hi there YouTube, uh, this is KG5EZH here, and today I'm going to be doing a review over the Make It Soldering uh, Starter Kit from Radio Shack. I uh, found that on sale for about $20, and it had a lot of good stuff in it, so I went ahead and got it, because I didn't really have a, a decent soldering iron. This this isn't probably good by any standard, but uh, it's a lot better than the one from Walmart, so uh, getting, getting started. So uh, I'll go ahead and open that up for you and show you around. Alright, so I went ahead and opened up the uh, the box there. And here's a little case that comes in. Uh, it's got a nice little carrying handle, and uh, it's very nice. Uh, I mean, it's decent quality. You can reuse it to store all this in here, which is nice. It's not just a crappy plastic packaging. So inside we have the base. And on the base it has a cleaning sponge, uh, which you can use uh, for getting solder off your tips. It also has a another sponge in case you uh, just burn that one out. Just uh, gets nasty, whatever. Uh, one of the nicer things about this kit is the solder sucker that it comes with. You can see here, uh, it's pretty nice uh, quality actually for, you know, for like a $20 kit. So, you know, you just go ahead and get a little button, you press down until it clicks. You press this button here when you want it to suck it up, and then it'll uh, suck up the solder whenever you need it to, uh, whenever you need to use it. So, that's one of the better uh, parts about this kit. Here's the little uh, wire ring stand. You can shove it in there into the base and you know put your iron down in there to keep it from falling off at your desk or whatever. Alright, we'll get to the iron itself in one second. Comes with some uh, solder wick from Radio Shack. Uh, these are usually about five dollars there, so that's a nice little added bonus to the little kit. And it has a little silicone ring. And I'll show you now. Um, I guess you're supposed to put the silicone ring over the little heat shield on here. Uh, I guess to keep it helps it keep it uh, keep in place right there, and uh, it takes a little bit of the heat away. I'm not too sure. That, uh, I just hope it doesn't burn up uh, or melt or anything. Should be fine though if they added it. All right, for the uh, pen itself, it's pretty small. Actually, uh, here's a sharpie to compare it to. So um, it's it's almost the size of a sharpie. So. It's, it's pretty small as, uh, as far as soldering irons go, and it is only 20 watts, So, but uh, apparently that, that can do a lot at 20 watts. It gets up to about 800 degrees, I read, so that's pretty good for uh, what, what this is for soldering little things. You might want a soldering uh, gun or soldering iron for bigger stuff, but uh, in line it has, the, um, has a switch for the on-off, uh, you know, just turn it on and off, which is really nice. You don't have to unplug it every time you want to stop using it or go do something. You know, that's that's pretty nice. All right, added in here is um, a little piece of rosin core uh, solder and two tips. It's got a chisel tip and a fine point tip uh, included in there. So I mean, it's a it's a pretty nice little kit for twenty dollars. Uh, I'll hopefully be able to maybe show you some video using it on a um, electronics project I have coming up, if possible. But uh, as far as I can tell, I, I would really recommend this by, uh, I think they're trying to discontinue this at Radio Shack, so if you see it in the next couple of weeks, uh, you might want to pick that up. Uh, you know, it, it seems like a pretty good deal for the price. So I would recommend this. Uh, I'll let you know how it goes, uh, how, how using it is uh, in the next next couple of weeks maybe. And uh, I would just recommend this over the price overall, especially. You know, it's kind of hard to get uh, maybe a solder sucker, some solder wick, some solder, and some tips, and especially this little stand and, and a sponge for less than twenty dollars. So uh, I would recommend you go ahead and try it out. So this is KG5EZH uh, uh, signing off.